In this video, we'll write the electron configuration for Na+. That's the sodium ion. So to do that, we first need to write the electron configuration for just Na, the neutral atom that's found on the periodic table. We know that this is a neutral atom because it doesn't have this plus or a minus up here. In fact, all the elements on the periodic table, they're neutral. Because of that, we know that this right here, this atomic number, that tells us the number of protons, since it's neutral, protons are going to equal electrons. We have 11 electrons here for the sodium atom. And we're going to spread those out around the nucleus when we write the electron configuration. So we'll use this chart here to do that. You can also use this table here. There's a link in the description how to do that. I think this is a better way to do it though. So let's start. We have Na. We have 11 electrons. So 1s, that's the first orbital. And s, that holds up to 2. So 1s, 2. We go across to 2s, 1, 2. So put two electrons in there. We've used four. Then we go over to the p. p holds up to six. So we'll put six in there for the 2p. Gives us 2p6. We have 10 electrons. We need 11. So we go over here from 2p to 3s and just the 3s1 here. That'll give us 11 electrons. So that's the electron configuration for sodium, but we wanted Na+, the sodium ion. To do that, when you have a plus here, that means you've lost an electron. Electrons are negative, so when you lose one, you become positive. So we just lost an electron, and that makes this the electron configuration for Na+. You'll notice that this energy level, the second energy level, the twos here, if we add up the electrons in the second energy level, we have two plus six, we have eight. That means that this energy level is full. That's very stable. In fact, this has the same electron configuration as neon. A noble gas. When sodium forms chemical bonds, it loses that electron to become positive so that it can have this very stable electron configuration. This is Dr. B with the electron configuration for Na, the sodium ion. Thanks for watching.